first of its kind meeting, the Reserve Bank of India has invited the boards of directors of private and public sector banks to a conference next month. Sources tell CNBC TV 18 the RBI governor is likely to address governance issues, among other matters, at this meeting. Ritu joins us now with the details of what the significance is of this meeting. Ritu. Well, thanks for that. You know, it's very rare that you see entire boards of banks gathered together under one roof and rarer still to have the RBI governor address them all directly. And so it's a significant development because we've been given to understand from sources that the Reserve Bank of India has invited boards of directors of both public and private sector banks for two in-person uh, day-long meetings which are scheduled to be held uh, first on the 22nd of May in New Delhi and on the 29th of May in Mumbai. The agenda which we've reviewed says that during these meetings the governor will address the boards of uh, banks on matters relating to governance issues, ethics, uh, the role of boards in assurance functionalities as well as set the supervisory expectations as far as RBI is concerned from these boards. Now what's even more interesting is that it's not just the top RBI brass which is going to be present for the meetings. So apart from the governor, the deputy governors, officials from RBI's uh, Department of Regulation and Supervision, uh, we're also expecting officials from the Enforcement Directorate to participate in these meetings. Again, uh, you know, this comes in the backdrop of instances of governance issues coming to light in some banks. Uh, the finance minister has also been giving repeated calls for improving governance in boards. And then on the other hand, we've seen commercial decisions of banks coming under the radar of investigative agencies, which has been cited as a cause of concern uh, by the industry as well. So the presence of ED officials is important. So let's see how this transpires. But the bankers that we've been speaking to have welcomed this consultative approach, uh, which has been followed by Governor Shakti Kanta Das. All right, Ritu, appreciate you joining us. Uh, that is uh, uh, an important story to track. Now, Kuo, a microblogging app that rivals Twitter,